video on um, plotting a simple graph or a function rather and then getting the first derivative of that um, at a specific point drawing in the slope line but also animating it as it goes along the graph it's a very quick program and very easy but I think it shows a lot of um, you know actually how much you can do in a short amount of time using MATLAB so first of all I'm going to create the function if um, and I'm going to make it very simple let's make it just 2 times x squared plus 3 and then we're going to use h to get our first derivative so I'm going to make it very small minus 5 and then to animate it I'm going to use a for loop and I'm going to use the k to be the x value from minus 2 to 2 so k equals minus 2 in steps of 0.2 and we'll go to 2 clear the, uh, the figure so we can animate it a is equals to k where a will be the point on the graph and then we're going to get our first derivative f a equals fival which is basically the function that we will be using which is f at the point a plus h f b will be using the function f at a minus h and then our slope m is equal to f a minus f b so the y values change in y divided by change in x which is going to be 2 2 h that is our slope then we simply need to plot the graph so I'm going to start off with hold on we want to put multiple objects on there f plot the function f that we created on top and I'll take it from minus 3 to 3 the x values and um, I'm going to plot the point A so at A and the y value will be F A and I'm going to use a red marker or asterisk okay and then we just need to draw the slope line so I'm going to create a short segment that I'll call XX will be lens space from a minus 1 to a plus 1 so it will change with our a value a plus 1 and then y I'm going to use the point slope formula I'm just going to take the y point over to the other side equals f a plus m times the x x we created minus point a so that is just a formula for the slope line. And just put a comma there. And then we're just going to plot it. X, X, Y. We'll make it red. And I'm just going to fix the axis. And that should be the program. So that the axis doesn't change every time we update our, our slope. So minus 3 to 3 and the Y from 0 to 15. And that should be the end of the program except I need to pause this so that we can actually see what's going on and if everything is correct that should draw our figure and animate the slope line 